So, <coughs> excuse me, for uh, part A, uh, just to find the wavelength, it's just uh, lambda equals uh, V over F. Uh, in this case, you use the speed of sound, 344 meters per second, and the frequency given is 1,000 hertz. So uh, 344 over 1,000 equals uh, 0.344 meters. And um, so then for uh, part B, we know that for a given frequency, the pressure amplitude of P max is proportional to the displacement amplitude uh, A. So if P max is multiplied by the so 10 to the third time, uh, if three, if, if you want 30 pascals, um, it would be uh, three times 10 to the uh, fifth meters. Uh, and then uh, part C, uh, we know that P max is equal to, P max is equal to uh, B, K, A. And we know that uh, K equals W, over V. Uh, so this shows that P max is proportional to W times A if you plug the K expression into here. Or equivalently, it's um, also equivalent to uh, the frequency times A if you also plug in this equation. And so if we want to reduce P max by a factor of 20, we must uh, also reduce frequency by a factor of 20, which means uh, 1,000 hertz divided by 20 is 50 hertz, and uh, lambda will end up being 20 times this value, which is 0.88 meters.